Well, hey everybody, it's Paul. Welcome to my desktop. I just want to show you a few things you can add to your comments that uh, kind of spice them up, and then I'll show you some other cool um, keyboard tricks I use a lot when I'm surfing on YouTube, watching videos. So uh, the first thing you can do is you can use the asterisk. Now that is to hold the shift key down and hit the 8, and it makes a little star. And then we'll type the word bold and put a star at the end of it. And when you publish it, that will bold that word. Now another one you can do is this is called the underscore. It's shift the minus key and then it will slant the word. They call that italics type text. And then we do it again. So it's underscore at the beginning at the end of the word. And then this is like the strike through they call it if you say something and then you it's kind of like sorry not sorry type of thing so you say it you want the person to see you say it but you crossed it out or what have you that's called um strike through so we'll just use um say hello and for that it's just a minus sign without the shift so just a minus sign hello minus sign and when you publish or hit the comment and publishes them, it'll have all these effects. And you can also use them together. So like you could do, say, you wanted to bold, and you wanted slant, and you wanted strike through. You could do that. Now we'll do something. If we got everything in there, so we'll try it out. Yep, so you see here it bolded. That's with the asterisk, the shift the A key. Then the slant, that's with the underscore. Then the hello, the cross out, strike through, that's with the minus signs, and then everything. It bolds it, slants it, and strikes through it. So I thought that's kind of cool. Now, here's my video, and say we're playing the video, and say we want to mute my voice, we hit the M key, and that mutes it. Now, let's say we want to go back because we just, uh, we, we got to see more of that smile and that gorgeous face, and we want to go back just a little, you can hit J, and that takes you right back a little bit in the video. Now say if you get to a part you want to speed up, you can hit L and that speeds it up a little bit. Jumps forward, jumps back, jumps forward. But the one I use the most is the K to pause. That way you don't have to grab your mouse and go over and hit the, uh, the pause button over there. And it works for them um, to start it back up. You just hit K again. There he goes. And then you can take off the mute by hitting the M. So here we jump back. See? I thought that's kind of handy. Just hit K to pause it. So anyway, guys, I hope these little things uh, help bring you more enjoyment to your YouTube experience. Thanks for tuning in. We'll see you.